Hello everyone, we're back. We got over the sickness bug. It took us quite a while to get over it. Um, we we're all sick for well over a week, uh, but we're all back to normal now. And then just when I was going to start vlogging again last week, I had a really bad toothache. Went to the dentist and he was like, no, that tooth's got to come out. Um, <laughs> and I don't like dentists. So, uh, yeah, I ended up having to have a tooth yanked out, which all my face was swollen and that I couldn't speak properly, so I couldn't really vlog. Um, but I'm a bit better now. Still a little bit sore, but it's not as bad as it was. Today, we have got to go and get the kids' school shoes. I ordered school shoes online for them. They've turned up and not one single pair of them fits. So I don't know why, because they were all sort of in the right sizes. I've just come to the conclusion that uh, this shoe shop sells shoes that are sort of coming up really small. So rather than send them back and then risk getting another lot that don't fit, I'm actually going to take the shoes back to the shoe shop um, and try shoes on them while we're there. And then I know obviously they're going to fit. I've got their uniforms, which are... Down now, um, they've not tried them on yet. They've got everything, everything's down there it's trousers, you know, skirts, jumpers, everything. Um, I haven't got anything for Tom yet because they've said, uh, obviously, you know, he's been homeschooled because there wasn't a place for him. I've spoken to the local authority, they've said they've been told people are leaving his year, but until a place actually appears on the register, they can't offer him a place. So I thought it was pointless to me buying him clothes just in case he doesn't get a you know a school uniform just in case he doesn't get a place. I am going to get him some school shoes today because there's nowhere around here that does kids school shoes. I've got to go sort of into town, so I'll get him some just on the off chance. And then um, if he does get a school place, the school uniform shops only down the road, so I can go down there and uh, just pick him up his uniform and that. Um, yeah, so that's what we're up to today, really. Go and see if we can get some school shoes that actually fit. Uh, size two. Yeah, I think that's no, no. the They look pretty similar. They look pretty similar. Stop! I just said, Charlie, can you give me his drink? Oh, uh, Mum, and second thought, these are way too big. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. This is exactly why I do it online. Because this drives me nuts. Does it? What, darling? I'm looking for your juice, baby. Hold on. Hey, how was this? Juice, juice. Juice, juice. Juice, take that. I've got no lollipops on off them, mate. I have. I just what? offered it to him, he went, no one tip. <sighs> I'm just thinking you had a bit I'm just thinking you've got some socks on as well. So I'm going to do a little bit bigger than what you've got on the new drum sheet. Um, what? Show them that. 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 Show them that's for oh, summer, really? it's not summer anymore. Did you try these on there, mate? Mum. Yeah. Tell oh, everyone God, this dress is shoe buying. It's doing my thing. It's driving me nuts. I can't. Oh, right. <laughs> you need a 13. <laughs> I think they're going to try one sign from the This is just aggro. This is exactly why I do it online. Which I can't cope with all this aggro. This is size three. Hey, are these with 13? Try these on. I'm looking for a size. No, I don't like them. That looks like they're the same as the ones you just put back. Is that your size? Where are these size two? Tommy. Tom, I will sort you in a minute, darling. Do you reckon? It's real tight. It has to be something. Right, leave it there then. They'll come back and get it. Have you made a de decision? No. Can you hurry up? Lily, what's wrong with them? They're still too tight. They jump around. They're not too tight, Lily. You've got plenty of room in there. They're not tight. They're stiff because they're new. What? What? Oh. Oh, you're not getting no. Mom, so, Mom, if Ted plays the guy in the <coughs> Maybe I'll shoot it one on the top, Mom. <laughs> <laughs> anyway, Mom, I don't know. Thanks. No, because they're not one on the top. What are these? Mom, yes. They're the they same shoes, they're like. Yeah, they're a bit small. Right, 
You haven't. I'm now at home. Um, no makeup on. Different colour hair. In a onesie. <laughs> you haven't gone mad. Um, I couldn't finish the vlog the other day. The kids were driving me absolutely nuts. I am never, ever, ever taking them out to buy shoes again. I'd rather do it online and have to send back 50 pairs. What's the matter? Uh, are they school shoes? I couldn't find my boots. Mom, I'm going to yeah. try yes, Why are you taking friend. selfies? I'm not taking selfies. I was vlogging. Oh. The vlog from the other day. I'm having to try the kids' uniforms on because they're back to school in uh, six days and I haven't got the uniform on yet. What's that? A That's a plum. That's a plum. Yeah, but guys, look. It's green inside. Hmm. Um, Bit weird. I haven't tried the uniforms on yet. They're back to school in six days and I don't know whether it fits. Done, Lily Mays. Hey, I'll show everyone the uniform. Stand up. Very smart. Obviously, the label's got to come off. I need to try it on because I need to label it all, um, iron it all. Hey yeah, guys, and, and I got new pajamas. You did get new pajamas, yeah. Um, yeah. So the other day, I got their school shoes, and then their trainers are getting too small. So I said to the girls, pick out a pair of boots, and you can have a pair of boots to last you for the winter, and pick out some slippers because all their slippers are getting too small. So I spent a little bit more than I wanted to, but I just wanted to get out of there. They were driving me nuts. It was so bad. And then oh, it was lunchtime. They'd not eaten. So they called me out for McDonald's as well. But mom, um, what should we call the guys? I'm thinking donut. No, darling. Um, yeah, so I just wanted to get home. I just, uh, and that was two days ago and I've not managed to finish it because I was busy all day yesterday. So today we're trying on uniforms. Um, Lily May seems to think that her school uniform goes well with slippers, but I don't think the school are going to have any of that. Uh, yeah, so I've got to try this on, label it, iron it all. Um, Mummy, show me my slippers! Very nice. Very nice. Um, yeah, just try and get them ready for school, really, because uh, they're back in six days, and it is, the time's just flown, but I can't believe the six weeks is gone. I'm fin it's just finished, it's just gone. I don't... It, Literally, I blinked and it's Mom, over. Yes, you can. I just want to show you my new bed. Look at this bed. This is our new bed. But it is so tall. Like, ridiculous. The first night I got into it, I was going to reach. Hold on to me. I'm scared of falling out. It's like an animal bed bed. It's so tall. It's nice. And it was custom made. Um, you sort of go to this website and you pick out what you want. Foot board you want. Um, stop it! Stop it! Look at my! Yeah, and uh, and custom custom make the bed up with the mattress. What bed? Nice. Jump it out of bed. I'm gonna keep jumping out of bed until the other videos. You're not going to put something on my bed, thank you. Sophie's trying to so she's mine it's too big. But I tumble all the clothes, because I do like six loads of washing a day, five, six loads. I can't get it all out on the line and dry, so I have to tumble everything. And it shrinks, it goes down a size when you tumble it. So I've tried to explain to her, I've bought a size up, because once I've tumbled it, it will shrink a size down. So if I buy her size, once I've tumbled it, it's going to be too small. But there's Sophie's. Very smart. Um, last year they had the cardigans with the school logo on, which the school prefer, but you can use just plain cardigans. And the reason I bought them like this is because 
the ones with their logo on are like 12 quid each and they're forever losing cardigans or getting cardigans next at school and I can't afford to be replacing 12 pound cardigans once a week. These ones are from Georgia Asda and they're only four quid. So if they lose it or it gets sold on or whatever, it's not that much of a loss, is it? I can just do some more. Um, so they've all just got plain cardigans this year. I didn't know when they started school last year that you could have plain cardigans. I thought they had to have the school ones, so I went out and bought them all. But I replaced probably eight cardigans last year um, at 12 quid a pop, so I'm not doing that again this year. Uh, I'm going to just buy them the plain blue cardigans instead of like this, and it's, it's no great loss, is it? Um, so that's two kids done, and luckily enough, they both fit. So, uh, bye, Hi guys. It's a mosquito or something. Hi, guys. Um, Tiffany tried her uniform on, and if it's put that back on Dad's desk before yeah. it goes nuts at you, put yeah, it back. We've still got Toby's crib mm, down here, don't Yeah, we we've still got Toby's crib. Toby's guys, in his big boy's bed it. for two weeks or so. Uh, and we're going to take the crib down this weekend, broke but we've got a pretty manic weekend. We've got a uh, Saturday, we're out all day. I've got my. Yeah. I'm actually pretty excited because we get to read Harry Potter books and stuff. Yeah, they do. Well, um, in year six at their school, they do a whole term on like, Harry Potter. And when we went to see the school, um, the Let's whole up, sort of corridor going down to the year six rooms, put it back, um, oh. was done up like the Harry Potter oh. hall. And they do a whole term on Harry Potter. Yes. And they go to look around the Harry Potter studios, which is quite cool as well. Harry Potter so, studios? Where's yeah. that? Uh, I don't know where it is actually. Wait, is it like a school thing. trip? Yeah. Yeah! Um, yes, yeah. yeah, so that's pretty cool. Yeah, but mum, when cool I get a place, when am I gonna get a school? You know what, mum, mum? When you mom, get a place, mom, yeah. Charlie's gonna be so jealous, and I'm just gonna walk by her saying, ha, ha. I oh, know, Charlie's meant to be going with her cousin to Harry Potter Studios, but um, yes, yeah, so we've tried on Tiff's uniform, that fits as well. Just as well, I ordered the cardigans in two different sizes because the smaller one was too small. Um, it didn't do an in between <laughs> size. She's not with 12 to 30, but it went 11 to 12, 13 to 14, and she's in the 13 to 14, so at least I've gone. Um, it's all finished. The crib has got to come down because Toby's upstairs and he's there. Uh, you haven't got a uniform, you haven't got a school place yet. Um, the crib's got to go down, but we've got a manic weekend. We're going to my brother's house warming on Saturday during the day. And uh, we're going out for a friend's birthday meal Saturday night. So we're, we're busy Saturday and then we're just working Sunday, so I don't know when it's going to come down. Uh, what's the matter? Um, we're going to move Toby's toys upstairs oh, as well, aren't we? Yeah, Toby's toys going upstairs. So, I'm excited um, for my birthday. I'm getting fingerlings, Monopoly, Twister and... I've got that just after they go back. They go back on the 6th of September, which is mine and Rich's wedding anniversary. Um, and she turns 11 on the 11th of September, which means she'll be the oldest kid in the whole school. Because she missed out on... Um, going to high school this year by 11 days. If she'd have been born before the 31st of August, she would have gone to high school this year. But she was born on the 11th of September. So she'll be, whereas most of the kids are turning 11 sort of later on in the year, she turns 11 as they go back. Uh, so she's going to be the oldest kid, oldest kid in the whole school, which is quite a, a cool status to have, isn't it, Tiff? Doesn't yeah. even boss everyone around, though. <laughs> uh, yeah, so... By the looks of things, everyone's uniform fits. I've just got to try and rise these since she's still in bed. I'm going to go and drag her out of bed. I'd like not last night. Um, so, fingers crossed. Everything's set now for them to go back to school. I've just got to iron it all and put their names in it and everything. Uh, and as I said, I haven't got Tommy a uniform yet because we still don't know if he's got a place. I contacted the council yesterday and said, is he likely to get a place? And they said, look, we're still waiting for the schools to get back to us. Wait a minute. So, on the first day back, I'm going to go in and say, are there any places in year three that uh, you can offer to Tommy? Um, I've been told he's the only kid that's on the waiting list for the school at the moment. So, fingers crossed, there's been enough kids left year three. Uh, and he'll get a place because he needs to be in school now, really. He's a seven-year-old boy, he's got no friends on and he's not going on any trips. Yeah. I'm just going to go get my Okay. Uh, yeah, so, fingers crossed, he's going to get a place. Um, and he can sort of go to school with the girls and then I'll only have Toby at home. And Toby starts nursery. Two days a week after Christmas, so I'll have two mornings a week to myself, which is not a lot, but it just means I can go and get a few bits done without having to take the baby with me. Mum, um, I'm beaming! Take that off your head, you don't put carrier bags on your head, please, it's dangerous. <sighs> right, uh, yeah, so Mama. thanks for watching this vlog, Mama. and we'll see you in the next one.